Okay. Uh, where is this? Okay, I've been over here already. I'm. What about over here? I see light over here, but it's pretty dark, anyways. No, I've been this way. It's just, yeah, that room was just dark. That's just iron. Um, probably haven't been down here. Oh shoot, I'm glad I didn't notice that in time. She got the torch, unfortunately, but I can just put another one. Another one standing right there. Hasn't noticed me yet, though. Now it has. Actually took damage at that, but it healed, like, instantaneously. Okay, there's an Enderman up here, but I'm not gonna look straight at him. That's just inviting bad stuff here. But I have to get past him to go on. If there is anything this way, but I think there's a, maybe a tunnel this way? I see an opening. Yeah, there's something behind him. I don't know if I touch him, I take damage or not. Never usually get close to the, the doctile ones. I don't know if touching it would set him off either. Okay, I've pretty much been everywhere around this area. Maybe not completely down below, but... Another one? So close to the other one? Are you kidding me? That's crazy. This one's acting like I messed with him. But I've never looked at this one, so I don't know what its problem is. It's still acting like I haven't looked at it, so I'm just gonna ignore it. If I, if I if it was acting the way it's supposed to when you see it, it'd already be teleporting on me. So Okay, apparently zombies have armor now. That's interesting. I think I just hit it up here, that wasn't very smart of me. Okay, here's some gold here. Only thing is I don't want to go too far if I'm gonna collect supplies because if I do that I'm gonna get lost down here and have no way of getting back up. I mean I guess you could always just tunnel upwards until you reach the surface but you'd be in the middle of nowhere. Actually I'm... yeah you probably wouldn't be anywhere close to where you started but you might be able to find your way back but I don't have a compass or a map. A map is something I really need to make. If I'm gonna make more areas like bases I'm seriously gonna have to have like a map or something to tell me where I've been and where I'm not and where my bases and stuff are I'd have to go look up how to make one though cause that's pretty much main priority is to cross the world, make bases find a place where an eye of ender actually reacts to where a stronghold is and then worry about getting the portal up. But for most of this... <laughs> I wasn't even thinking about that happening, but I'm kinda happy it did. Uh, for most of this playthrough I've been playing it very safe and just staying by my spawn and my house. And I sort of want to branch off farther into the world, beyond my jungle and desert. That's partially why I want to make a port over towards uh, the ocean, so I have... Oh, come on, just thank you. That was ridiculous how long it took that. It took out half my health that way. But yeah, that's primarily the reason I want to go out to sea is that that's pretty much the because from what I've seen 
from outside and out across the sea is just desert. It's all basically desert on my side of the on my side of the uh, ocean over there. Like I found like two villages out there and both of them were in the desert area. I'm actually wondering what happens if you put multiple beds in different places. Does it just, uh, if you die, do you just go to the nearest bed spawn, or what? Because I know what incorporates into being a spawn is if you have a bed inside of a building or something like that. Get back up this way. I must have killed something over here because there's an experience point down there. Yeah, I think this is where I killed the zombies actually. There's a spider down there just hanging out. I'm back towards where I started, huh? Random bat flying at me. Don't know if those will attack me or what. I have no idea. Okay, so the entrance is somewhere down there from where I made my my marker. I guess I must have just circled around because I'm not exactly sure how I got back here. But that's fine with me. I can go back up to the surface now because I'm basically out of hunger. I don't have any choice but to drop, I think. I'll have to build like a staircase here or something later on. Or maybe I can just makeshift one now, but... Uh... Oh shoot. You're not near skeleton shooting at me up here. He's around that corner. I think he's stuck. So I think I'll just drop down and... Take the damage. Yeah, it was just one heart. Okay, I know the entrance is around here somewhere. I know for a fact it is. Random creeper down there. I don't think that's down there. No. Skeleton's probably that way, so I don't want to really go that way. Ah, shoot, it's downstairs. How'd you do that? Oh boy, this is a bad situation. Okay, I know that's one way out above me, but... Okay, I need to work fast. Oh, shoot. Okay, this will keep me alive at least. It shot me with an arrow right when I reached, uh, like, a heart and a half. I'll just have to make a way up. There we go. That'll have to do. 
That was too close. But we did find that we did manage to get out of there alive at least. Look at that massive crater that I can just see from here. Okay, let's put some stuff in here. And suicide pit. Let's go ahead and put our armor back on. I should probably take it off and put it in the chest before I do this. Because I'm pretty sure it's probably wearing it down as well. Wasn't even thinking about that. Okay, guys, I think what we're going to do now is we are going to, we are going to mess with some animals here. Let's see if we can get one under our control. Probably a dog would be easiest, as what I just read <laughs> tells me that, uh, Uh, bones are used for getting them. This cat here is just being silly. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Hope these two bones are enough. Usually they're always over here in this little forest area. Oh man, our crop field, I completely forgot about that. <laughs> it's kind of terrible to be honest, but... I'm sure they're probably already be harvested by now. Where are they? I usually can't find enough of them everywhere. There's a spider. I don't want a spider though. I want a wolf. Where are they? Did they migrate somewhere else? Because I don't see any of them around here, and I usually always see them just hanging around this side of the forest here. How odd. I usually never have a problem finding them. Maybe they moved farther on to the other side? I don't know. Don't see any. 
don't see any at all. I see a zombie on fire. I don't know why I'm seeing that. Oh wow, he's actually smart enough to go into the water. Oh man, here's one right here. Did they all fall down this hole? I'm gonna get that one. I'm gonna save him because he's stuck down there. Doesn't even look like he can move off that block. There we go. Come on, Fido. Gonna have to make another set of stairs up here. Is he gonna follow me or what? Okay, yeah. I guess these dogs can help you in battle or something. I'm not exactly sure what they do. But I figured, hey, let's grab one while we're here. I think the catch you have to have fish for, and I don't have a fishing rod. Oh, I found another wolf. Apparently they're more towards the crops over here now. I guess it did migrate a little bit. Yep, it's right behind me. I guess it's just teleporting to keep up. You hear that? It's running with me the whole time. Alright. I guess it went through water a second ago. I think I have a puddle up there. I don't remember where the minecart is. I think it's at the end of this, on this side. So I'll probably have to go up there and get it. By the time I get up there, though, it's probably going to be nighttime, though. Hey, yeah, let me see something for a second. Yeah, it does teleport, because <laughs> it just teleported right on me. Okay, so you can make it sit. Yeah, it can swim. Kind of need to tested that because uh, I need to know if it was going to drown or something trying to cross over the ocean with me. I think the end of the rail is right up there. Yeah, or that, or... Why did I put this block here? I don't remember. Oh, I think that was one of my starter markers. But this is way out here. There's no way this was... for that first mine I found. This must have been like a marker towards the ocean or something I did. Well, at least we can have a fast way back. Okay, here it is. The ocean. I want a port right off this side here and just fill it with boats. Actually, I don't know how fast boats are, but it's still better than swimming the whole way. Having to sit there and hold space bar the entire time like an animal. 
Luckily, I got a lot of stone from making my way down to that new mine. Don't know if it's going to be enough, though. Hopefully it will be. Okay, there's no creepers or anything around me, so I think it should be okay to build without having to worry too much. Um, I'm doing this off of just random. This is going to be a small room. It's going to be off the side. It's going to have stuff like a crafting table, maybe like a chest. I don't know if it's going to have a bed in or not. If it's a fully done thing, then I might do that. It's already night, so we're going to have to mad dash over here and get back to the house. Luckily, the minecart's right there, and the enemies aren't spawning yet, I don't think. I don't know what the dog's going to do. I think it's just going to keep on like teleporting with me while I'm running up here. It's on sand, I guess it can't go, so that's kind of there we go. Just gotta wait for it to hit the first power rail. So far nothing's here. It's definitely night though. Oh, here comes the monsters. What oh, zombie that was way too close. So at least I know this thing can outmaneuver. The enemy so far. Okay, skeletons can still hit me though. <laughs> Alright, that made it pretty easily. And the dog just teleported the whole way here. Okay. Go ahead and turn it back to day. Come in here, dog. Come on. Is it not coming in? Is it not going to buildings or something? What are you doing? Okay, it's too dangerous to be out here. I don't need something sneaking up on me. Beautiful day. Everything's on fire. Okay. Let's head back and start working on that port again. It's gonna be... It's gonna have a small room, and then the rest of it's gonna be like an area where the boats are hanging. The only bad thing is that it's not gonna be completely safe against monsters like this building is, it's gonna have to have an opening for the boats. So that means at least one possible access point for some monsters to get in. Minecart! Where are you going? What the heck? <laughs> This creeper won't leave me alone. Only reason I don't really want to fight them right now is if I hit it back, it's gonna blow up on the dog. <laughs> His dog is always constantly behind me. <laughs> Seems 
seems like there's more creepers than usual here too, it's weird. Yeah, I have at least four blocks of uh, stone to work with here. I'll take, f f yeah, I think I have three right now, so I'll see where I'm at after I use up these three. Huh, I've never seen a creeper move that fast before. Oh, this takes forever to hit this first rail. But I have to use the power rail sparingly, because I don't have that much gold to work with. I can't wait to have this thing finished. It's not too much farther at least. I think we still have plenty of day. Okay, that should be high enough. Three blocks is usually pretty high uh, to make a room with, because you're only about two blocks, I think. And it's already one set of block down, so this might take more than I thought. Um, I think I might place a window here. Just have a window outside, see if there's any enemies around the entrance. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave that area right here open. So I can see directly into the boat room like this or maybe put some glass there if I have the chance um, this area over here is gonna be where the boats are actually gonna be at it's gonna be a little dock here and then I'm probably gonna put a roof over this too because if I don't then I'm gonna have to worry about spiders overtaking me in the night I'm surprised there hasn't been any more, like, aggressive water mobs. The only mob in the water is the squid, and they don't do anything. <laughs> you think there'd be, like, sharks or something. That makes water, like, one of the safest places to be. The only thing you have to worry about is the naturally drowning aspect of it. I think that's about, no, I think it might be one more, one or two more blocks. Okay, now I think it's equal. So this is the foundation of the dock area. Get rid of some of this. Uh, 